in this question we have to calculate uh, the average and RMS value of this voltage waveform. So here is the voltage waveform which is triangular in nature and this height, this amplitude is equal to K1. Let us first calculate the average. Okay. First let me calculate the average value between time d equal to 0 and capital D by 2. What will be the average value? Average value or the average height of this graph in this region will be equal to the total area under this graph divided by the uh, width of this space. Now the area of under this graph that is the area under this of this triangle will be equal to half into height k1 into base d by 2 and then I divide this by the Base, base width that is t by 2. This is the average height which will be equal to k1 by 2. Notice that uh, if I calculate the average value uh, for this region between capital T by 2 and capital T, it will be same as k1 by 2 because this uh, graph is symmetric around this midpoint. Since the average value uh, for this first half of this graph is same as the average value of this uh, second half of this graph, therefore the overall average uh, over this complete cycle will also be same as this quantity k1 by 2. So this is the average value. Now next uh, let, let me calculate the RMS value of this graph. But before that, uh, let me calculate the mean squared value okay, or average squared value. Notice that this voltage V can be written as V equal to uh, K1 T divided by capital T by 2 for this region between time 0 and time capital T by 2. Okay, so this is the this is the expression of the voltage in this region. So therefore if I square this voltage V square will be K1 square T square divided by T by 2 whole squared and if I draw this graph V square that will possibly look like this graph, this curve. Okay, so this will be this square. Anyway, uh, now I want to calculate the average of this uh, green curve uh, that is the v, that is v square. And what is average? Average is once again the area under this graph divided by the width of the base. Now how much is the area? Area is equal to integration of the graph v square dt starting from time t equal to 0 to capital T by 2 and then you divide this by the base width which is t by 2 that will be the average squared value. Now this will be equal to uh, integration from 0 to capital T by 2 V square is given here K1 square T squared whole divided by T by 2 whole square DT and then divided by capital T by 2 if you simplify this K1 uh, is constant T is constant so I can write them outside the integration k1 squared uh, t by 2 whole squared okay and then integration of t squared dt starting from 0 up to capital t by 2 and then whole divided by t by 2 so let me make it t by 2 cube because of this another t by 2 uh, in the denominator okay so then this will be equal to if you do this integration 
k1 squared by t by 2 whole cube integration of t square is uh, t uh, cube by 3 and the limit of integration is from 0 to capital T by 2 if you put the limits you will get this uh, to be equal to k1 squared uh, divided by 3 okay so this is the average of the squared value now what will be the uh, so this is the average this is the average for this first half of this graph now if i also calculate the average for the second half of this graph you can see that the graph of b squared will be again symmetric around the midpoint so therefore the average of v squared in this second half will also be same as the average of v squared in this first half therefore the overall average within this complete cycle uh, overall average of v square will also be same as this over the complete cycle so this is our average squared value or mean squared value and therefore from here we can write rms value will be square root of this mean squared value k1 square by 3 which will be equal to k1 by root 3 and this is the answer